Revit 2023 introduces new electrical preliminary design capabilities. You can conceptually define electrical systems with relevant electrical analytical information directly in Revit. Unlike traditional methods of using disconnected workflows with spreadsheets, PDFs, and other files, this provides one environment in which to define your electrical loads. You can create area-based loads using a variety of reference data such as an architectural RVT, DWGs, or PDFs. Start by going to the Analyze tab Electrical Analysis panel, then select the Area-Based Load Boundary tool. You can show or hide boundary open ends from the drop-down menu. The open ends enable you to more easily and visually validate that the boundaries form closed areas. There are multiple ways to draw the bounding area. You could use a rectangle box and then align each segment where you would like them. Or you could use pick lines and go around the exterior of the area and trim the bounding lines. The Electrical Analysis Panel also has an area-based load tool. This allows you to define loads to estimate total building power requirements. The Area-Based Load command defaults with the Add Load Area option enabled. Select one or more regions enclosed by the boundaries and the Area-Based Load is created. The area-based load populates in the system browser analytical power distribution view under the unconnected node by default. You can rename area-based loads from the shortcut menu in the system browser or in the properties palette. When an area-based load is selected, you can choose a type from the properties palette. Clicking the browse button opens the electrical analytical load type setting dialog. Within this dialog, you can edit, create new, duplicate, and rename electrical analytical load types. Set the power density, load classification, power factor, and resulting apparent power density for each area type you would like to define. For specific loads, the equipment load tool is also found on the electrical analysis panel or from the system's browser. When an equipment load is selected, the properties palette allows you to set the voltage, power factor, apparent load, and load classification. These new tools allow you to conceptually define electrical loads during preliminary design, providing a single source of truth in Revit.